Today I am going to be doing a review of the Dean Razorback 2257 string. We have lots of really cool features on it. Um, you can tell this is a very, very pointy guitar, which if you're walking up a set of stairs or you're playing in a really small <laughs> venue, be careful not to swing your guitar around because you could probably take somebody's eye out or impale them on the corner of your guitar which wouldn't be very good. Apart from the shape of it, it's a pretty fantastic guitar. It's a mahogany guitar, it's a 25 and a half inch scale. You have a set of Grover tuners up here. You have a Floyd Rose licensed tremolo system. You have the locking nuts there as well. You have a pair, these are my favorite feature of the guitar, a pair of EMG 707 pickups. And you have a three way selector switch, as well as two volume controls, one for the neck, one for the bridge, and you have an overall tone control for the whole guitar. This is built in Korea and is a fully mahogany guitar. You have a mahogany neck, a mahogany body, it's a set neck as well. So we'll twist that around, you can see that there like that. And you have a rosewood fingerboard, you have 24 frets. So I'm going to stop waffling and let's just play the thing.
to finish off about this guitar, my final verdict is if you love power metal, speed metal, or hair rock, like old school 80s rock music, or hair metal, or anything like that, or are a massive fan of Pantera, I say this is the guitar for you. It's very versatile in sound, but if I rocked up to a jazz club with this, I think everybody would start laughing at me. So I'm not going <laughs> as well, but the tone of this is lovely. So I mean, if you want a versatile guitar, to be honest, I'd recommend, or if you own a seven string that has the capability of taking active pickups, I would get myself a set of EMG 707s because they sound amazing. To be honest, as a guitar, feel-wise, build quality and how durable it is, they all score very highly. I think this, my only downside, which to be honest is a very big downside of the guitar, is just the shape. It's not a practical shape, and to be honest, I wouldn't use this <laughs> like for many other styles of music other than shredding. But if you're a massive shred head, or you love your power speeds, or just Pantera style metal, then this is the guitar for you. I hope you've enjoyed watching this. Uh, don't forget to subscribe and I hopefully will see you soon. Take care. Bye.